first installment of Master Pace Theater. I'm your host, T.J. Burkett. We've dug deep into the USTA video archives and will now take you back to 1980 when DeCoin, Illinois hosted its final Hamiltonian among the cornfields and the corn dogs of its state fair. The Southern Illinois Fairgrounds, built by W.R. Hayes in 1942, began hosting the Trotting Classic in 1957. We'll take you there now with a piece entitled Last Time in DeCoin. Enjoy. In 1957, the DeCoin State Fair, a patch of dash, splash, glitter, and charm etched into the farmland of Southern Illinois, was hailed widely. Its lush green landscape, country innocence, and elaborate extravaganzas of sport and spectacle produced an aura befitting the crown jewel of harness racing's major trotting stakes. For one of the few times in the history of the classic, Grand Circuit flags wave on Hamiltonian Day over a home other than Goshen, New York. The new home of the Hamiltonian is the DeCoin State Fairgrounds at DeCoin, Illinois, where more than 30 years ago, the late W.R. Hayes began transforming 30,000 acres of bleak, barren strip mining land into what is now acknowledged as one of the most beautiful fairgrounds in the world. In the middle of this land of lakes and lagoons, he laid out one of the finest and fastest trotting tracks in the world and then began bidding for the privilege of staging the most famous harness race in the world. Mr. Hayes died before his Hamiltonian dream came true, but his sons, Gene and Don, carried on the campaign. Racing fans began arriving early in the morning and are shuttled smoothly into the grounds and down tree-shaded lanes to the grandstand area where the county fair atmosphere, which so typifies harness racing, prevails in abundance. Major magazines of the time flatly predicted DuCoin's hold on the Hamiltonian would last. A more perfect home was not likely to be found for a long, long time. Ironically, Less than a quarter of a century later, many of those same sports journals were again pointing to the reasons that had made the DuCoin, Illinois home so ideal, but this time, identifying them as reasons why the race was being moved once more. The race had become an institution, bringing instant fame to the horse and driver that won it, enormous prestige to the racetrack that hosted it. Granted, the 1979 vote to uproot the stake was close, on a second ballot, 12 directors of the governing Hamiltonian Society voted to change location, away from the county fair atmosphere, which once so typified harness racing, to the lavishly swank Meadowlands track in New Jersey, with its promise of a million dollar purse in 1983, and even greater media exposure for the Hamiltonian. Besides, the Hayes family, long the gracious custodians of the stake, no longer owned the fairgrounds home, having sold it early in 1979 to Iraqi national Saad Jaber. That last tie to its past broken, the Hamiltonian would begin its third major era at the Meadowlands in New Jersey, but that wouldn't begin until next year.